Today, we are turning Blender into Photoshop. Well, not literally, because then I will have to turn Blender into a paid product with a questionable subscription term otherwise. Instead, we are diving into my delusional quest to make an image layering add-on for Blender. I call it Paint System. And guess what? It's free! So you can download it, love it, break it, or improve it, your call. So, why am I doing this? Well, blame Arcane. In the behind the scenes, an artist casually mentioned that the painterly look was achieved by, well, painting. Revolutionary, right? So let's do the same. Normally, painting a 3D object in Blender, you would have to deal with something called nodes. And it can be very hard for beginner artists to just get started using 3D. Well, here's the solution. Paint system allows you to paint directly on your 3D object with features like layer clipping, blend modes, and animatable opacity, and it's so easy, it feels like magic. Paint system is essentially creating and modifying nodes for you. Okay, so first, download paint system add-on by clicking the link down below. After you download it, go to Blender, Edit, Preferences, Add-on, and click Install from Disk. Select the .zip file you downloaded and boom, it's installed. Now, when you open this side panel, and there it is, the glorious paint system panel. Now here comes the fun part. Click Add Group, okay. Click Add Layer and I will choose Image Layer. And finally, toggle Paint Mode. And that's it. You're ready to unleash your next masterpiece. It's that easy. You want custom brushes? Well, just click Add Preset Brushes over here. You can paint, erase, tweak your layers to your heart's content. You want to remove part of your object? Well, switch the brush to Erase Alpha, and I will turn this solid color layer off because, well, it's a solid color, and I will just paint out the 3D object like this. It's just like a layer in Photoshop. The magic behind Paint System isn't really magic. As I said, it still uses nodes. When you click Add Group, the add-on creates a new node group in your material. And you can place it wherever you want. And you can even add multiple groups for different tasks. So for example, let's fix a shadow. Add a node group and call it Shadow Fixer or something else, and then select None for the preset. So the add-on will only add the node group and not mess with the existing material. Now, plug your shadow setup. Mine will be Diffuse Shader and Shader to RGB node, and I will turn the alpha on because I want Paint System to use the color input. Delete any solid color layer, and voila! Now you are painting directly over the shadows. You want a tune shader? Easy, paint out the unwanted shadows, run the output to a color ramp, and set it to constant. Done! You can also paint the normals. You can add this normal setup and go wild. The system is simple, yet flexible, designed to make 3D art more intuitive for artists. I developed this system alone, and to be serious, Photoshop is an amazing software. And all I want is to add those features into Blender for you artists to use. If you want to give any suggestions, feel free to do so. And now it's your turn. Download Paint System, play with it, create something amazing. You don't have to credit me, you know, just, just keep creating. I hope you have an amazing new year with this new tool. Remember to have fun and happy blending. Bye bye!